Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today I have with me our new little puppy. Um, he doesn't have a name yet, so if you have any cool name ideas, just leave it in the comments below. But that's not what this video is about. So today we're going to talk about the fourth principle in Jonah Berger's steps, which is public. And the way that he explains it in the book and in some of his videos is that when we see people doing something, we are more likely to imitate it. And we saw this in some of the videos that the professor provided for us. And today I want to talk about the bandwagon effect and some of the places that I've seen it. So I was going through some old video footage that I have and that my fiance has and there were a few videos that stuck out to me and it got me thinking about the different communities that we have and how we're more likely to imitate people who we admire or just who are in our friend groups and so on. And today I want to highlight a little bit about the Marine Corps and the military and just men and peer groups in general. So this first video was taken on a deployment in Korea, but as you can see, I cut the audio out due to a lot of inappropriate language. So as you can see, this is a group of Marines, and as they reach the top, most, if not all of them, flip off something in the right hand of the video. And the thing about this is they weren't told to do that, and all of them did it anyway, so I thought it was interesting that people tend to follow each other and do things that they think is either funny or cool. So I remember seeing that video for the first time and just thinking, wow, this is really weird, why are you guys all doing that? Um, <laughs> But then I realized that this is something that most people do. And for example, in pictures with my girlfriends, if someone throws up the peace sign or sticks their tongue out, I will follow and most likely other people will follow. For the second video, I am going to give you a little background about it and then I will have you guys watch it. So this next video was taken on the same deployment, but in Japan, so it was taken after they had trained with some of the Japanese Marines. And in the video, there's a slight difference between the uniform of the Japanese Marines and the American Marines, but pretty much what you see is the American Marines chanting the song and even though most of the Japanese Marines can't understand it, they are getting hyped up as well, and you can see some of them screaming, and it's just a really cool video. I thought this was a really cool video and I thought it showed a good example of how even with language barriers we tend to follow or imitate what other people are doing, how they're feeling, and just the overall energy. So the next video isn't really a video but it's a screen recording of a Facebook post that my fiance posted and all of the replies that he got from a lot of his friends, most of which are in the military. And again, here's the Facebook post that my fiance made. He got a new suit and some expensive whiskey, so he wanted to post that on Facebook. And in the comments, there were a lot of his friends who felt the need to or the want to share their experiences and their favorite whiskeys and their opinions. 
And this just goes to show that people really do want to share their experiences and they do want to be a part of what you're doing and follow what others are sharing. So that was my take on Jonah Berger's aspect of public in his steps and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If there's any opinions, I would love to take constructive criticism. Please leave it in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.